Duchess Meghan Markle's headline-making fashion choices are continuing to turn heads this holiday season, even when those fashion choices are almost entirely hidden from public view. Like you can't see me in my dress. We sure can't see you in your dress, Megan. But according to gossip site Pure Wow, a few from the neck up Pavarazzi snapshots of Markle in a car revealed that the Duchess of Sussex arrived at the Queen's traditional Christmas luncheon at Buckingham Palace in this sheer black floral printed dress designed by Erdem. A sheer dress is a bold choice for a Christmas lunch, especially when it's lunch with the royal family. But the former suit star's latest striking fashion statement appears to be a repeat. Markle wore the same ensemble during her appearance on the Today Show back in January. January 2016. Fans of the British royal family may already be aware that Markle's recent Erdem look, however recycled, marked a departure from one of her go-to designers over the last year, Zivanchi. Markle donned a gorgeous white Zivanchi gown for her wedding to Prince Harry in May 2018. Since then, the Duchess has gone for Zivanchi on multiple occasions, including a navy blue coat and dress outfit at Princess Eugenie of York's nuptials in October 2018. In related news, Markle and Prince Harry spent Christmas Day with Prince William and and Duchess Kate Middleton, following rumors of an ongoing feud. These reports were only fueled last month amid reports that the Sussexes planned to split from the Cambridges by moving out of Kensington Palace and into Frogmore Cottage on Windsor Estate. Rumor has it that Markle has been less than wonderful to royal staff members, allegedly earning her the unflattering nickname Duchess Difficult. There have also been reports from insiders that William and Harry have clashed over Markle from the beginning, with William concerned about how quickly Harry and Meghan's relationship developed. Earlier this month, the Kensington Palace rep plainly denied the rumors, telling the Sun, none of this is true. This However, royal expert Katie Nichol later told Entertainment Tonight, For Christmas Day at least, William and Harry are going to have to bury the hatchet, put a few wobbles behind them. It's not like they're not talking, they're still incredibly close as brothers, but there have been fallouts, there has been tension. Christmas is a good time for goodwill and forgiveness, so let's hope we see the princes do just that. The royal Fab Four were indeed all smiles on the morning of Tuesday, December 25th, while walking together to the Church of St. Mary Magdalene at Sandringham through the English country. Countryside. During the family holiday outing, Markle showed off her growing baby bump while pairing a navy blue Victoria Beckham coat with black boots, just weeks following surprising reports that the Duchess has rarely donned her famous pals brand. After greeting onlookers and attending the church service, the royal family were said to have gathered for lunch at the Queen's estate before watching her annual Christmas speech to the nation. With two weddings and two babies and another child expected soon. It helps to keep a grandmother well occupied. After sharing this sweet nod to her ever-expanding family, the 92-year-old Queen of England shared some wisdom with her royal subjects while making a call for tolerance. Even with the most deeply held differences, treating the other person with respect and as a fellow human being is always a good first step towards greater understanding. Hopefully, any drama surrounding Meghan Markle's arrival in the royal family will settle down in the new year, and her fashion will stay as bold and refreshing as ever.